there's one. What's going on guys? Chiefs here and today we're going to be switching it up with an awesome video. We are going to be going out casting glow spoons for King Salmon. We just got a nice lake flip. I'm here on a beautiful northern Michigan beach and we're going to go cast the sunset. See if we can't catch some staging King Salmon. We just got a lake flip. It's a phenomenon here on the Great Lakes where the cold water has risen to the top due to, at least on the Michigan side, north, northwestern winds and uh, there's still plenty more fresh fish here on their way inshore. So we're gonna be casting tonight. It's gonna be throwing some moonshines, Cleos, KOs, and uh, the goal for this trip is to see if we can't land a nice mature king salmon. Ideally something 20 plus pounds, but wow, what a beautiful afternoon. This is amazing, guys. I'm actually gonna be running a float rod. This is my 11 foot medium heavy fast action mags custom rod here and I'm using the longer rod because the longer length of the rod is going to help me cast out these spoons a little bit further. I'm going to have it paired up with a size 4000 reel I'm using light monofilament, not really light, it's 10 pound. Those moonshines can't, aren't, I don't think that they're totally th three quarter. Here's one. Yep. Is it a coho? It's a coho. <laughs> I'm gonna eat that little guy. Switch to the KO. And this fish is getting KO'd. Perfect eater. There's one. There you go. There's one. Nice. Damn, this thing's freaking out on the surface. I don't know if it's a king. It might be a nice sized coho. Finally, it's got this nice female coho on the spoon. See if we can't get a king, but take that all day. Nice five, six pounder, full eggs. Probably got some good meat on her too. Looks like the bite might be picking up a little bit for us. Nice. So, so you're the Chiefs? Yeah. That's you? Yeah. Is it? yeah. <laughs> I've seen your videos, quite a few of them. Really? <laughs> yeah. Hell yeah. Nice, man. What's your name? Frazier. Frazier? <laughs> nice to meet you, buddy. Oh, I need motivation for a big mature king. Come on, man. Those guys don't even have a stern light, do they? Oh. Oh, whoa. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, no. Dude, I, I have this dude's prop. It's my only KO. Oh, I'm actually so irritated. I'm just throwing a freaking green KO. Oh great, this guy's gonna fucking take my line out. What's that? Uh, it's like east right now, actually. Oh my god, dude. Come in a little closer next time. That guy just, I've lost two spoons of people cutting my That guy came in so close. It's insane. I don't know how people do this. His name's Frazier. Seth knows him. 
Oh my god, and I just lost the top half to my rod. No. Yeah, here, hold up, I gotta go. Why, 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 why? Right before king season, I just casted that thing right in. There's no chance I'm getting that back, dude. He just wrapped that for me, because that's a replacement rod. It's okay. it's okay. That's just one of my guide rods. It sucks. Mm -hmm. uh, of like the wind behind your line. Mm hmm. Man, I, I just dumped some line on that reel. What's your philosophy on moon phases on the pier and stuff? Do you think these like. Brighter, brighter nights are better casting. Uh, a couple years back, my buddy, he was trolling like every weekend. There's one. There's one. This might be a king. I don't know. Yeah, it's probably. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Is it over your line? Yeah, you're on it. Here, I can probably go under. I told you, I had a good feeling, man. I had a good feeling. I casted my freaking rod into the lake. I was like, you know what? I I took a little took a little time out there for a minute, and I that one crushed me. Here, you want to follow me to a corner here? Sorry, I don't mean to get in your way, but he's running all the way across this way. Yeah. First one, huh? I hit a nice coho just a little bit ago, too. I know, he's waking up. <laughs> if you can gain on him still. He's right there. I see. Thank God. What's your name? Uh, Jason. Jason? I was so close to leaving. I'm so happy, man. He saw, dude, I just threw the top half of my rod in the lake. This guy came flying in on a tiara, cut all our spoons off when we were casting. Oh, dude, this is not, this is gnarly. I don't know how big he is. I, I don't, I can't tell if he's big or not. I mean, but yeah, so the guy cuts my line off or both of our lines off. I'm reeling it in, I got like 10 feet of slack out or whatever, and I go to bull whip the line back into my hand, I just threw the top half of my max rod like 20 feet into the lake. I don't know if he's 20 plus. I'd be freaking stoked though. Imagine it's like a 20 pound lake drum brown or something. That did not take long, man. We're all talking about the moon phases and we think the high noon. What, what do you, I mean, what do you think? Do you think that the high noon, or the high noon, sorry, I've been drinking too many of those stupid things too. Oh, it's right here, it's right here. Yep. I don't think it's that big, I can't tell though. It's not bad. Oh, it's a nice one. All right, he's surfing, he's surfing, he's surfing. Come on, come on, come on. You got him. Yeah. Nice. That's not a bad one. Ain't the biggest, but it's a nice one. Took a couple good burns on me. Beautiful dorsal, nice wild fish. Oh, I'm the K O. <laughs> could you pass? Could one of you guys possibly pull this guy out? It might not be too bad. Cool. All right. Well, yeah. I'm kind of towards you a little bit. Nice. There's one. Yep. I think it's coho.
Yeah, you got it out. Maybe it's a kang. Right under this guy's bolt. No. Nah, it's probably the same size as that last one. Yeah. He's like right here. Yeah, it ain't that big. So, or is that king or coho? I don't know. Well, it's coho, isn't it? Damn. Damn, another football. Another it's king. king. It's a king. Wow. Jack. Little stalker boy. Might let him go. It might be his lucky day. Nice little five year old. Right. Numero tres. <laughs>